Saludos a todos and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Castlevania Symphony of the Night for the PlayStation 1 on the Xbox Live Arcade. On the last episode, we went around here somewhere on the reverse outer wall. Sorry about that, my television was way too loud. On this episode, we, as promised, are going to the inverted library, I don't remember the name of the place. This is not where I want to be. That is not the teleporter, and it's definitely not the... Actually, I could have, I could have used that. Okay. Uh, so, the first stop is the teleporter. And then the library. I suppose... I think this is the... The teleporter. Yes, it is. And with that activated, let's go there. I mean, the library, of course. Open up! Now, as you might have already noticed, there's a slight change in the recording um, settings. Well, okay, it's more than just slight. Yes, I got myself a high definition capture device specially made for games at least that's what the box said and yes this is how you play symphony of the night in a full 180p yeah since the game was for the oh god you already whoa what the hell are you uh, move move okay so you are the lion another smooth yes this place is filled with smooths this is the ice one no it's the holy one okay so you are sort of weak against um holy uh but as i was saying since the game was originally that looks nothing like scarecrow was originally for the PlayStation 1 and it didn't have widescreen. Well, this is what we get when we're playing a widescreen. But hey, at least we can see. What? What? No, I wanted that! Oh, come on! Oh my god! I hate this so much! <laughs> and it was on the other side. Okay, are you weak against Holly a little more? Over here, there's nothing, but, well, we get the library card, an opal, and some turquoise. For selling, since, well, we don't have a shop in the Inver Inver Castle. Let's see. I, I, let me just see something here. Let's go to system, and... Wait, was it here? No, actually, it was in start. Uh, help options, uh, settings. Yeah, we have enhanced graphics. Let's go to the original to see how it looks. Pixelated! Actually, I like this more pixelated in high definition than the enhanced uh, stuff. Why? I have absolutely no idea, but I like it, so deal with it. We are going to see Alucard in its full pixelated glory, if, if, if you like it or not. If you like, like it or not. Get away from me! <sighs> okay, so there's a thing you might have noticed, maybe not. This kind of a dark ref darker reference. I don't know if dark is the word I'm looking for. But well we have here the scarecrow and a lion. Also the robots I think are called Teen Men or something like that. These enemies that we find here in the actually just in the inverted gallery, uh, gallery, I mean the library, are reference to Wizard of Oz. Yes, those are, 
weird references, if you ask me. But reference nonetheless. We have the Cowardly Lion. These things I don't really know where, are, where they are from. We have the Scarecrow and the Teen Man. Actually, there's nothing here. What the heck? Okay, whoop! I hope my TV isn't loud enough to uh, get recorded in my microphone. But well, if it is, well, what to do? Here we have some resist stuff. Might come in handy later. As in, maybe I will never use them. But they are there, if you need them. Onward to this place. Actually, what, wasn't there a way? Is it here? Yeah, I think this is where I went. Yeah, okay, it's here. Let's quickly save. Because I don't trust my luck. And let me just turn down my volume a little bit more. That should be enough. Okay, so we are on the other side of the library. Let's see what waits for us in what? Actually, I, it's not hurting a lot. Maybe when I played this game, I was a little bit under level when I came here. Maybe. Okay, I'll wait on that bus because I know there's a boss there. At least I think that there is. There was one in the other castle. Okay, let's see the name of that one. It is Teen Man. I was right. So, yeah, there are your references for Wizard of Oz. Actually, I don't know why, why I was so scared of this place. True, these are pretty scary. To say the least. But hard? No, not really. And I killed that lion like it was nothing. Almost finished with this place. Actually, I don't have a timer. Oh my god. I do I just noticed that. Neutron bomb? That sounds kind of dangerous. Yeah, I don't have a god freaking Timer, okay. Yeah, so I suppose this will be either a long or a short episode. I'm going to say long. I don't know why that happened, but okay. I'll try to finish this sort of kind of like trying to calculate I, I'll try to guesstimate the time that I am running this I hope I okay there's no boss in here I was wrong there's one of these and maybe there's something further up maybe Actually, I'm kind of wishing there is the clock. Actually, I think I'll keep the damaging weapon. Okay, so there's this. What's behind it? I star a light. What the hell is that? Let's see. Strengthen powers of. Cr okay, so if you have the cross sub weapon. This will make it stronger. Now, I, I don't think I've, I've used the cross as Alucard, but it's the most powerful sub weapon he has. It also uses 100, 100 hearts per use. So, even if it is really strong, it's really, really expensive. You might want to have that just in an emergency perhaps on the final boss maybe okay so there was nothing of interest back there so uh, I wanted to go somewhere else mm, as I said I don't have a timer so, mm, 
what to do. I guess I'll go there and see how it goes. Smooth! Get away from- uh. Uh. I hate the schmooze. Not because they're hard, because they're annoying. I suppose fire would be good against this scarecrow? Even if this version of the scarecrow isn't made of a straw or whatever it is made of. You think... Also, why was... Well, I don't... I suppose this is part of Dracula's castle, even if it's upside down. Why was Dracula hiring... Um, fairy tale characters to defend his castle. They are stronger than zombies, that is correct, but still I don't see why. Well, I don't know. So, there was nothing there. At least nothing of interest, as I, as I said. Let's go somewhere else and hope this doesn't turn out to be a one hour long episode. If it turns out to be a really, really long episode, I'll split it in two and... Well, I don't know what I'll do. I suppose pause them at the same time. The thing is, I know that we can make long videos, like definitely more than 15. I mean, I've done like a lot of more than 20 minutes. But I don't want it, this series to be, well, tiring to watch, so to speak. Why is that? Well, I'm putting all this in a playlist, so future generations, or new generations that are currently w starting to watch, can go back and it doesn't take long for them to watch one single episode. That is my state of mind and I will keep posting shorter sh shorter episodes actually I'll come back there later Sh oh I want these these potions luminous okay so what is that sounds strong sword forged by elves it's as strong as a holy sword. Mm, okay, I'll change my ice rand for the Luminous. Doesn't have a power. Whoop! Maybe it's... What? Okay, no, it was like... It wasn't because of it. And that happened. Overkill. <laughs> Okay, so the Luminous doesn't have a power. Uh, and maybe it has, but I don't know how to activate it. It took me quite some... Whoop! A little time to figure out that to activate the staff, the shields, the ball of the shield stuff. Uh, actually, yeah, I'll keep it that. Oh, my... Oh, okay, the Dragon Helm. This is way better than this. See that? I lose a mint, but it's just one point. And right now, I am not using my spells a lot. Oh! One health! Ha! <laughs> Actually, this helmet would have been a little bit more useful back in the library. I mean, I wasn't getting that much damage, but... Oop. Okay, maybe it's a smart... Whoop! Maybe I should use my... thing to prevent stoning. Yeah. Um, not that kind of stoning. Uh, it's... Is there even something here? No, there isn't. And I missed a spot. Uh, where is that spot? Right in here. There we go. <coughs> Sorry. 
Whoop! And... Whoa! Hello there! Well, still one damage, so that's happening. Come. Okay, it's not better. And yes, in case you were you were wondering, did did I kill that guy or was it my son? My, I mean, my familiar. As you were, if you were wondering, yes, these things are back. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, let me just quickly talk about stoning. Ugh. It doesn't deal any damage when you're stoned, when you get turned to stone. But it does damage like hell when something hits you while you're like stone. Uh, I demonstrated, but no thank you. I think I'll speed this up just because this is kind of tedious. Oh, okay, that's fine. So I'll meet you when all of these are active. So be right back. Okay, for a moment there, I thought... It, these sound glitches, really, I hate it. You think by, by importing this to the Xbox, they would have made it better. Okay, so in the secret room we have a diamond, a life apple, and the sunstone. Now, the sunstone is the exact opposite of the moonstone. You will get more power when you are playing during the game. So let's head down. Oh, screw you guys. I don't. Oh, come on! Uh, there we Oh, secret. It's still here. Move to the. Whoa, okay, so I got resist stone. Nice. Let's go back to this other secret room. Not so secret room because. It, uh, this is one of the most obvious breakable walls in the game. I mean it. Mean it. So, on one side we have more life, and on the other side we have more hearts. And here these guys will continuously respawn whenever you leave the, the screen where they spawn. Did you get all that? Yes, I did. And I think I'll find a save point and, and call it a video because I'm... Guestimating this is longer oh, than my usual videos. And easier said than done. I have no idea where to save on in here. So maybe a larger longer episode? Maybe. Perhaps. Because I do want to finish this area. Oh, okay, so I was in the wrong area. Uh, but the moon rod, nah, that's <laughs> pretty fun to use. Don't think I'll use it as for right now. But I'll show you guys all the weapons that I have. And also, I was asked if I was going to get all the shields. The answer is yes. I'm planning on getting all the shields to show their abilities with the shield rod. Um... So let's start. Those bomb knights are really weak and also fun to kill. Why? Well, because you can actually deflect the bombs they throw at you and kill them with them, like so. It deals a lot of damage to them and it's not that hard to do. Just... Yeah, even, even when coming straight up to me. That was a breeze to send back. I don't know what I'm saying. So let's hit. Oh, <laughs> that was nice. MLG. Oh, come on. Ooh, a coin. I think there's something here. Yes, there is. And there's also something. In here. 
Yes, a Buaca knife. Um, I'll use all the items that I have, even if only to show them near the end of the game. There's no boss here. Lame. And we are all the way back here <laughs> to the to this place. And yeah, uh, I thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment either if you like this episode or not. Jalisco, out.